robbers man mm. right. yeah, yeah. <coughs> where are we going uh, we're gonna go down to the town hall down to the uh, plaza yeah and that's where I've been going down to have my lunch just recently when the weather's been better of course I was down there a couple of weeks ago and um, there's this guy who appeared there. He was just wearing a suit. You know, a pretty much standard white collar geezer. Except for the fact that he's wearing this big sandwich board. Well, like end of the world is nigh kind well, of thing. Well, kind of. All this stuff on it about these hardships that he's had with uh, uh, the SIS and, and people like that. So is that like father's agency? No, 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 no. It's um, SIS, it's a secret intelligence oh. service. Oh. And he's, he's walking around around the square. Well, this is in Barra. Yeah, this is Barra. This is the odd thing. If, I, if I'd have seen that sort of thing happen anywhere else, you know, if I saw it up in Trafalgar Square in London, I wouldn't have thought anything of it. And the next day, he's there again. And he's stomping around. Anyway, this time he's got to me, sat on my bench, and he's sat down. And he's introduced himself. Hello, Mr. Secret Policeman. <laughs> what, to what? you? He's yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm just thinking, you know, totally loopy. I told him to go away anyway. But he just wouldn't leave me alone. So I ended up going back to the office, finishing my lunch there. I thought, well, if he's, if he's so paranoid about being spied on or whatever, I'll go down there with a camera and I'll, I'll take blatant photos of the guy and maybe that would just scare him off. At least he won't talk to me, you yeah. know. He keeps his distance a bit more, but as he's walking around, he keeps talking to me. This is when, the, this is when it all got a bit weird. It all a bit strange. Something that's got me pretty worried, huh? It's um, very, very odd. Very odd. But um, let's get down to the town hall anyway. I'll explain what happened there. Right. Um, so you're walking past and just sit down and just ramble at me. You know, it was the other day and he was walking around doing his usual thing and he got to over there and that's when it happened. There were these two guys in like darkened suits. Um, they looked like sort of like how you'd imagine. Uh, it, was, it was like something out like the Matrix or something. There's these guys in like dark glasses. Oh, like you men in black. Yeah, men in black. So it's like your atypical men in black, and they just kind of like appeared out of nowhere suddenly. And I watched it all happen. I watched it all happen, and they kind of like walked either side of the guy who stood here, and. Um, and uh, for no reason at all, he, he just sort of like, his, his knees gave way. And, and they sort of caught him and then just bundled into a car just down there. Like a dark car, with like blackened windows, smoked out windows. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And they just threw him in and, and then just drove off. What, and like there was no one else around? No one saw out of? Well, know. no, there was no one else around. It was just, you know, it was just me. So, I mean, it happened so quick, there's nothing I could do. I mean, I legged it over it to have a look, but... You know, they'd gone. How many, how many were there? Well, I mean, but there were two of them. Well, I assume there was another one driving or something. But there were two of them, um, actually, uh, who, who bundled him in the car or whatever. I'm just really nervous that, like, someone's watching me or something. Yeah. Well, there's, I mean, I mean, there's, like, offices up there. Look, there's, like... There's offices there. This is, like, the town hall. Yeah. There's a police station over there. Yeah. Which is like a really odd thing. It's like, how did it just happen? I mean, why would it happen here? I mean, this is just a small town. Why would are there it... any cameras or, you know, are there any like CCTV or something like that? Well, I can't see any. You know, there don't appear to be any anymore. I'm just really spooked by it. It's really, really yeah. weird. So if he was just like, yeah, wandering around, then loads of other people must have. Oh, I don't know. And then he's... Phil? Where the fuck's he gone? Phil? What? What's he at? 